I thought we might start um, with Richard Dawkins, a famous, well-known atheist, who not quite converted to Rome, but has said he's a cultural Christian. Do you think that's a good thing, to have people who look at the history of the nation they live in and realise that Christianity has been fundamental to how it has developed and accept that as a basis for the morality and the legal system of the nation, even if they don't believe in God? Absolutely, absolutely correct. Christianism, especially Catholicism, is so good that even if it's not true, it's the best thing we have. That's why Europe is so uh, loved by the whole world, because our the, everything that Europe was created in Europe is so attractive to the whole world because it has Christian roots. And we should be very proud of that. Uh, absolutely. Well, there's the wonderful book by um, Tom Holland called Dominion that explains that it was Christianity that created any concept of a welfare state, of looking after your neighbour, and that to the ancient Romans this would have seemed bizarre because they didn't have that understanding of the value of the individual person. Absolutely correct. And that's why Europe is so attractive, because we have this extremely good social system. We look after the poor. We look after the sick. We look after the weak. That's, that's only because of the religion. We have the most beautiful castles, the most beautiful cathedrals and churches, because we have built and created the whole architecture, the whole zeitgeist was for hundreds and hundreds of years only to please God and to do things that are pleasing to God. And this has infounded itself in the mentality of the European people. If Even if today we're trying to abandon this and go towards barbarism, towards Roman, like they were in Roman, the Christian roots are what makes Europe so singularly attractive to the whole world. And we should be proud of that. 